In this video, we will get the absolute and percent relative uncertainty for problems that have multiplication and division only. So the first step that we would do for this type of problem is just multiply 2.75 times 1.25 divided by 0.72. We would get 4.77. Next, we want to get the absolute uncertainty and also the percent relative uncertainty. And for multiplication and division, the first step that we would get is the percent relative uncertainty. Now this is unlike addition and subtraction, which was the last video. So first we will get the percent relative uncertainty. So let's do that. So we would get the square root. So what we have is the 0 0.05. We say 0 0.05 and we divide this by 2.75, 2.75. Next, we multiply this number by 100. We close parentheses, then we square it. Likewise, we do the same thing for the other two numbers. So we get 0 0.02, we divide it by 1.25, then we multiply it by 100, and then we square it, plus the final one. So we get 0 0.03, divided by 2.72, we multiply it by 100, and then we square it, and now what we would get here is, is equal to 4.82%. This is our percent relative uncertainty. So we'll write 5% down. Next, we will calculate the absolute uncertainty. So what we would get here is we take the 4.77, we take the 4.77, we multiply it by 4.82, 4.82, and then we divide that by 100. This would give us 0 0.2299. So we write down here plus or minus 0 0.23. This right here is the final answer, where 0.23 is our absolute uncertainty and 5% is our percent relative uncertainty. And that's all we need to do for problems that exclusively deal with multiplication and division.